Greetings, beloved. Way back when we were in some very beautiful area, I used to go, we, we used to go to church on the Sabbath, and uh, on the road we passed through a stream. And I used to wonder looking at the stream, and something just kept in my heart inquiring. Then I used to love these stones at the river bank. Then I would pick some of them. I always got intrigued. The stones that we are used to, you, that we used to, that are not on in the in the river, they are sharp stones. They are, are very rough stones. When you pick one of those stones that are at the river bank, when the water has receded, now you see that these stones are very smooth. And they are round. And to think that that change was brought about by being in the water. Through time, the water has smoothed the rough edges. It has made these stones to be smooth and round. That has a spiritual meaning for all of us. Jesus, the water of life. If we are hidden in him, the rough edges of our life, these rough edges that we prick others with, we injure other people, we are difficult. But when we are hidden in the quiet street of the water of life, our sharp edges are rounded off and we become smooth, we become kind, we love other people, we become compassionate, we are not selfish, we begin to think of other people. We become a blessing in the world. But only through the water. And that can only be possible when we are connected to Christ. And we are hidden in the stream of the water of life. That Jesus will do to us. The path of the righteous is as a shining light. And shineth more and more unto the perfect day. God will smooth us. He will clean us. He will make us what we ought to be only as we subject ourselves under his care and we accept him in our lives to be what he wants us to be. May God bless you to that end. It's my prayer and passion and hope for you. May God bless you.